John, you've done that to people, <laughs> but rarely do people do that to you. What a performance from Ronnie. Yeah, it was incredible. I, I didn't really get much of a chance. A uh, couple of half chances, reds. But, I, yeah, I don't even... Did I, did I score a point? Did I? Four penalties. <laughs> Aye, so, listen, every credit, he played amazing. His cue ball control was was amazing. Uh, I, God, I've, I've had a few defeats like that lately. Now people have just played played out their skin really and it's just it's that's just the way snooker is sometimes you just just sit there and admire the other guys sometimes nothing you can do two players though today mark selby and sean murphy have left here with lots of regrets you can't really be too down on yourself after a match like that because it was more about the fact that he was unstoppable than your mistakes yeah yeah and listen just take the positives i wasn't i wasn't in this tournament a week ago so picked up a good bit of money now that, that I wasn't expecting and and Ronnie just played really too good for me so that's it just uh, back on the horse next week going to China and see what happens out there One final question, you've played him so many times right from the start tonight it looked as though he was zoned in and up for it, could you tell? Yeah, no, uh, you, you could yeah, you could uh, and when, he, when he's like that you, you need to take every every half chance available to you and I just never took them. There was a couple of reds now that I, I didn't really get close to and, and I went in off, maybe a couple of bad shots as well. But listen, that's me nitpicking there now. Just when he plays like that, he's, he's pretty unstoppable. John, thanks for coming up. All the best for the rest of the season. Cheers, pal. Thanks, Paul.